Alright people, welcome to day one of a new lesson. We are going to be making some dragon eyes. So the first thing that you need to get is a dragon eye. I guess really we're, we're making the eye socket. So get your dragon eye. And next you're going to need some of this model magic. Okay, so I already have some in here that's pre-mixed up. You can just grab some of this. This one is pink, purple, white. Now, if you get some that is um, just white, you can mix it up yourself. So, I'll grab this. Okay. This is about how much you need right here. Okay. And we do not have an endless supply of this stuff, so don't waste any. Okay. Then the first thing you're going to do is make your base. So you only need about this much for the base. Just roll it in a ball and then you can press it down. And then you can just kind of shape it. So you can pinch it this way, smooth it out here. It can really be whatever shape you want for the eye socket of your dragon eye. But something like this is good. So see how it's like thinner than my finger is. So it's not super thick. All right. Then you just stick your dragon eye in it like that. And all of this can definitely be white. You don't need that to be any color. Now let's say you want to decorate it. You can just take some more of this. And let's say you want to change the color of this. So you're only going to really be able to get pastel colors. So let's say I wanted to do like a pastel blue. So I just, of course, hold the tape, pull out some of this marker, and I color right on it. And my markers are drying out. I don't have any more at the time of filming this. Towards the end of the year, drying out my markers. And then you just can mix it up. And it will turn into that color. And it will dye your hands a little bit, but these are washable markers, so eventually it will wash out. Okay. So this one is still pretty white. I switch colors to green just because, like I said, this blue. I don't have much of that blue left. Okay, we'll do green instead. So you just color it. And then just fold it together. Like that. Okay, there it is. So it's starting to turn green. Yeah, it's getting to like kind of a greenish color. Okay, so you could add more green to that and make it even a darker green, but just for the sake of this video, I'm going to be done mixing mine just so I can show you um, some ways you could decorate. So, of course, there's reference images you can look at for different ideas, but essentially the point is to just kind of make decorations to go around the eye and you can even make like scales if you want to push into it the scales for your dragon eye and the point is just to be as creative as you want to be everyone's dragon eye is going to look different um, you could do different colors and then also you could use the marker right on top of it too like so as well so that's also fine all right and you can use different colors besides just like the one green color like I did and then you just decorate it however you want just look at the examples for more I'm not gonna do more to mine because I want you guys to be able to get started but all right thanks for watching I'll see you in the next one bye